What do you say, friends? Old buddy Wildcard checking in with you from uh, beautiful Fort Smith, Arkansas. I'm making my western swing. No, not professional drag racing western swing where they circle out through the western end of the tracks on the spectrum. No, whenever I get to Arkansas, that's my western swing because that's about as far west as I can go uh, and still get home on the weekends. So what you see behind me here is a load of what we call shiny bar. It is a steel bar. We get it of various lengths and diameters. It is milled to a polished uh, finish. They use it to make uh, different things in the automotive industry. This is the type of material you'll see if you look at a backhoe or something like that, that shiny piece that comes out of the hydraulic cylinder. That's the shiny bar that you see here. Get you a shot from the end. You can see how we've got it secured. One thing to notice is to build this bulkhead up front. This is why I like to carry extra square timbers for uh, building bulkheads that are plenty high enough to cover the top of the shiny bar. And you can see we've got our straps running down the side. We've actually got two different sections here. You can see in the middle, that's where they split. One neat thing we do with these is put a butterfly strap around the front and back of each bundle that wraps around and pulls it to the opposite side. Helps for stability. So uh, just pick this up here, O Dark 30, this fine October morning. Going to get it tarped and covered. There you can see the end of it. Uh, I've had it in larger and smaller diameters before. So. Gonna get this tarp and deliver it Friday to Mooresville, North Carolina. Hope all is well with you and all of yours, and thanks for coming along on the journey.